Welcome back, folks, to another episode of The Walking Dead, Season 4, the final season. Suffer the children. Not ready. You can do it. Come on, James, you can do it. I knew she was done. I can't it. keep carrying you. Oh, I'll be inside soon. Rest now. Shit. Is he? He's alive. He was shot. He's got a fever. Come on, let's get him inside. I can't. Okay, buddy. I got you. You got bit. Oh no, it was a freaking uh, shot. He got shot. Never mind. He didn't get bit. He got shot by the freaking. Yeah, I remember. Oh shit. Let's see what happens now. Let me see. Oh, I have what I need upstairs. Come on. We got the shrapnel out of him. We? It's uh, a long story. He's running a fever. Body's trying to fight infection, poor little guy. Ruby and Lewis will take care of him. You come with me. We can talk in the office. Clem, shh. You just try to rest, okay? We're gonna fix you right up. Clem! So AJ, sad. listen to Ruby, okay? She'll look after you. Come on. What do we do when we're scared? When fear starts to get the upper hand, we, we say, say fuck off to fear. <laughs> I'm good now. <laughs> That's my boy. That's little AJ right there. <laughs> fuck off to fear. Clementine, please. We need to talk. <laughs> oh, that's great. That's great. <laughs> okay. Start to buy it. Let's see what she's keen to say about us. Oh what happened God. out in the woods? I saw they had you pinned, and I. Shit, I got so crazy. When I heard you call for help, I didn't even think. I just let go of the arrow. I wasn't even sure if I'd hit her. And then Louis got shot six, six inches over. We'd be digging another grave. I really thought you were dead, Clem. It's just everything is so fucked right now. So it's no. disappoint. Sorry to disappoint. You'll have to put up with us for a while longer. No disappointment here. I'm glad you came back. Huh. What about the what others? About Mitch yeah. and the others. Oh, uh, well, they're less excited about it. Lewis and I told them what happened in the woods. That woman who attacked you, Lily. So you do know her. We were Long wondering. Story. Who the hell is she? I mean, I know you're not like we were friends. her group, but the others don't like the coincidence. Her showing up right after you? I mean, Lily and I were friends a long time ago. Friends? Back when the walkers first showed up, we lived in a motor inn. Mm -hmm. Survived really awful shit. Lily tried to keep us all together. Looks like she's changed. 
Yeah, seems that way. We killed her father. She murdered we someone. Freaking in our group. smashed Lily's father with a salt argument. lake. Carly was her name. She refused to let Lily push her around. A barn. It was right at the start. No she I haven't changed. seen Lily since. I believe you. But there's something else. Lily said someone was with you at the gates. James. He saved me and AJ. Let us stay in his camp for the night. But why did you bring him here? You led him right to us. I mean, he's a stranger, Clem. Running into those two in the woods, it proved we can't trust anybody. James is in the flood. I'm not trying to be weird. I'm I just <laughs> don't want everyone in the world to know where we are. Willie said he was wearing, I don't know, animal skins or something. Walker. He was wearing walker skin. That's how he gets past herds. He can guide them, too. <sighs> wow. Okay. I wouldn't have brought him here if I thought he was a threat. It's not that I don't trust you. I'm just worried about the others and what they might do. They didn't even get a chance to mourn Brody and Marlin before these child-snatching assholes showed up. And then you two come back after we thought you were dead. Now they're confused and no one knows how to feel about AJ. Violet, AJ is the least of their worries. I know, but everything is such a mess. They're scared and angry and they're looking for someone to blame. I mean, they kicked you out. How am I supposed to make them change their minds about you? It was decided. Five to three against. You're sitting in Marlin's chair, aren't you? You're their leader now. They'll listen to you. They don't, though. They only listen when they want to. Well, they'll have to start if they want to survive what's coming. Mm. Can I be in Marlin's chair instead? I survive longer than you guys. James Real. told me what Lily and Abel will do next. He Maybe said not. they'll get more people and guns and come attack us. Take everyone here. How the hell would he know? He's watched them for a while. They're at war with another community. They take people to fight for them. Is that what happened to Minnie and Sophie? They turned them into soldiers? Yeah, it'll happen to us too if we don't stop them. Minnie didn't even like killing walkers. Look at this place. It's a fortress. Nothing like Terminus, though. We could make this place really hard to attack. Do you actually know how to do that? Yeah, I was part of a siege once in a town called Richmond. Oh my god. Here, let me show you. A new frontier. Uh, remember, new frontier shit, okay. We've got good, strong walls. We need to make them hard to climb over, so the raiders have to come in through the gates. We used to keep barbed wire in the greenhouse. Okay. Uh, this is where we should make our stand. There's only one way in, the front, and then there's the big central staircase. If we rig that path with traps, we can pull back here. Luring in our attackers. I like it. Alright, this... The courtyard's pretty wide open, not a lot of cover. We should flip the picnic tables, narrow down the pathways through it. So we'll know which way they're coming. At the very least, it'll give us protection if they get past these walls. And where else? This far right here, eight, eight. Something. Well, you guys don't use the greenhouse anymore, do you? No, we used to. Then we lost someone out there. Walkers overran the place and Marlin wouldn't let us go back. <laughs> Safe zone. We need to get that barbed wire, so they can't climb the walls. I'll go. Are you sure? It's gonna be swarming with walkers by now. Okay, what the hell's going on? Lily told me she was back, but I was like, no way. Violet wouldn't just go against what we all decided. Shh, would you keep it down? The little boy's asleep. His fever's already going down, Clem. Mitch is a gonna bitch. be okay. Great. We're just giving them our medicine, too? Mitch, those people who shot Lewis, they're arming up to attack the school. We need Clem's help. Like hell we do. For all we know, she's one of them. She's not. If you saw their leader's boot on Clem's neck, you'd know that. Use your head, Mitch. You saw AJ on your way in. If I was with the Raiders, why would they have hurt him like that? How do I? Exactly. 
Maybe he shot one of their friends. Mitch! Clem's going to the greenhouse to find barbed wire and anything else she thinks we need for the fight, and you're going to help her. Uh, no, I'm not. Yes, you are. It's too dangerous for her to go by herself, and you're good in a fight. I can go too. You know, to keep the peace. Oh. Fuck, Vi. Since when are you the one making the calls? Since no one else stepped the fuck up. These two will meet you at the gate, and you can head to the greenhouse once I've explained the situation. I'd rather go alone. I'd rather go alone. I don't want Mitch or this girl here. I want her to help AJ. See you there. This is kind of freaking sucky as hell. I'm so sorry, little dude. Please be okay. Hey. I... Stable. I guess I didn't realize how long it's been. How much it's changed. Ah, uh, this ain't budging. You gonna stand there sulking all day? Or you gonna do something useful? Well, we need that barbed wire. There must be another way in. Oh, freaking bitch. Where's he going? Okay. Mm, I can't see shit. Well, there's too much condensation on the inside. Condensation? That's a big word for you. But shut up. Okay, someone's not mad. Mad. Oh, I want to talk to Mitch for a minute. What do you want? Uh, nothing. You're only here because we're desperate, you know, so don't get comfy. If we survive these raiders, you and I are gonna have words. Let's no. survive first. Uh, that's not what I meant by talking. Decision making. Right. Be that window. I bet we can get in there. Good spot. Let me Mitch, off. come here and give me a boost. Wait. Make her go first. We send the one we don't mind losing. Fuck you. That's an ugly thing to say. I I'll go that. first. I don't mind. Figured you'd fight it. Thanks, Clem. Holler if one grabs you. Otherwise, we'll come as soon as you give the all clear. I guess we'll know when the door opens. inside here. Walkers. Plural. Walkers at the same time. Clementine! Clementine! I'm fine! Oh, thank God! Wait, 
is it? A swarm of walkers, there's only three of them. Jesus Christ, man. Not bad. Shut up. Oh, look. Wild ginger. Eastern prickly pear. Jerusalem artichoke. False Solomon seal. Let's find that barbed wire, and anything else that might be useful. Talk to Ruby. You seem happy. You can only eat the same bland rabbit stew so many times before you go crazy. These herbs are gonna do wonders for morale. You wait and see. Okay. Go ahead, cook them all. Find something? Yep, maybe useful. A shovel? Okay. Pry bar. Ooh. Yes, please. What else? We grew up the knife that was here. Could be oh, a weapon. A or use it to dig a grave. You Can weren't there when we dug the holes for Marlin and Brody. We had to use cups and bowls. Took forever. Mark, dude, Mitch, just be quiet, man. Just be quiet. Don't don't say crap. I hate you too much right now. Wait, what is this? No. That 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 didn't work. Okay. What is that barbed wire that she was talking about? Oh. Some mushrooms are edible. Did you find anything? What do you think? Okay, just asking. You know, the barbed wire idea is smart, I'll give you that. Those assholes try and climb our walls, they'll tear their guts out. I kinda like to see that. Barbed wire inside here? Wire. A lot of it, too. That should keep the raiders from climbing our walls. Hey, we can use these. For what? We can make bombs out of these. Bombs? Are you serious? Totally. It's the kind of stuff I made back home. He used to blow shit up. That's why he's a troubled youth. Guilty. I just need some propane and something to create a spark. And we'll have ourselves a nice little homemade explosive. That's a good thought. Coming from Mitch, the bitch. Okay, let's just get out of here then. No? Not yet? Okay. Oh, we have to grab the barbed wire, aren't we? No. No. What are we doing? Oh. Remember right, there's a science lab through that door. Maybe there's propane in there. Come on, help me move this thing. We need 
it's not bad. It's actually pretty cool. I don't mind them like this. Oh my god, there might be walkers on the other side. Okay, let's see what's inside. Okay, no walkers. Now that I'm not. Oh, yep. Yep. What? What? Rose! What's going on? You all right? We had a scare, that's all. Oh no. What? Who was she? Miss Martin. Our nurse at the school. Oh, she stayed when all the others left. God. She looks. Doesn't eat or anything. That's what she's like. That. You can barely recognize her. I'm oh, sorry, sorry, Ruby. I, I just wish I could make her look like she used to. One day we came out looking for food. Walkers attacked us. Thought we could fight them off, but there were just. There so many. Ms. Martin told us to run, so we did. She taught me how to patch people up. Stitching, local anesthetics, painkillers, fever reducers. I don't think I can take care of her. Would you? I'm sorry. This is like that, uh, that memory, that, uh, part when we have to shoot, uh, duck in the middle of the woods. But we didn't shoot him. Oh, we did shoot him. Oh my god, we didn't have to do this. He was dead. Are you okay? Yeah. Just need a minute. Come on, guys. Help me find that propane and we can get out of here. biology but you know who knows you oh, find anything I actually I don't know what this is we hope nobody's was uh, nobody would broke bad in here <laughs> breaking bad joke not fun Ugh, looks like piss dare you to drink it not in a million years wimp Drink it. Drink it. <laughs> I can give it that magic mushroom. It's funny. Oh, got traps. Why do we treat the Venus flytrap? Why we, we don't have to use it? Okay, no. Hmm, let's hope there's gas in it. <laughs> we can do it. Present. Yeah, perfect. Here. Good find. We got the propane. Now if we could just find something to create a spark. Mm. Okay. You seem to know a lot about bombs. I made my first one when I was eight. Really? I blew up the garage. It was awesome. Though, Dad didn't think it was awesome. Dad gave me a chemistry set to keep me from fighting the neighbors. Uh, why would you fight the neighbors? I had a lot of energy. I had to use it somehow. And they didn't like my face. I wonder why. OK. 
Okay, let's look for something here. Right. Ms. Martin meant a lot to you, huh? She was the only one who stayed. She saw us for what we were. A bunch of kids who no one wanted. She loved us when nobody else did. Like, really loved us. Yeah, I've known people like that. I guess everyone has. What is this? There you go. Uh, Mitch, is this useful? Plans. Fucking A. I was hoping there'd be one of those. That's an igniter. We can use it to create a spark. It's the last thing we need to blast those motherfuckers to hell. We should get back and tell the others. Not until we bury Ms. Martin. Bury her? Why bother? It's a walker. Help me drag it out back. We can burn it. No. Ms. Martin's the reason we're all alive. And? She deserves a proper burial here. Next to the greenhouse she loved. That way the others won't have to see her like this. She's been dead for years. There's no point. I'll help you bury her. It's the right thing to do for someone you cared about. Thank you so much. It's not a her. It's a walker. Fine. Whatever. I'm not wasting my energy on that thing. Damn, he has a bad, bad temper. I'll put a stone in the graveyard, back at the school. But Ms. Martin loved this place. She'll be happy here. I'll make sure everyone knows you helped me. That you've got a, a good heart under all that muck. <laughs> hey. <laughs> That's nice. Making friends. Think it'll be enough. Hopefully, and it means Lily and her people won't be able to climb the walls. They'll have to come through the gates. We can plan for that. Straight into a fiery explosion of death. Assholes won't know what hit them. Okay. Old ghosts. Okay. Trophies. Left and right, man. Brought you these. Mm. I noticed his shirt got messed up when, you know. Where did you get those? They were tens back when he got here. Should be about AJ's size. How's he doing? Better. Better. His fever's yeah. down. Thank you for carrying him in. No problem. This guy's not bad. I like him. So we've got a greenhouse again and bombs. Mitch's idea. I figured. Violet says we'll start getting this place ready in the morning. Good. They all seem okay with letting you stay. For now, yeah. For now, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> While we get ready to fight. Without me. You're gonna need me for the fight that's coming. Yeah. Sounds that way. Everyone else is okay with us staying. What about you? It's fine. Well, he gets better. And after that? I don't know, Clementine. Clem? Hey, kiddo. How do you feel? Better. Still hurts. I know. Hi, Louis. Hey, little dude. I missed you. Are we friends again? Please say yes. Just get some sleep, okay? Ah, oh, damn, man. Make him feel better. Say yes or Lewis? something, man. I'm sorry that you're hurting, and uh, it's our fault. It wasn't all you. Marlon, he... Mm. Forget it. I, I should go. Okay. 
not mad at him anymore. Are you? He helped carry me, and he was by my bunk when Ruby gave me stuff. Medicine. AJ, I was never mad at him. I understand why he acted that way. Why he wanted us gone. I don't. I was right. I know, kiddo. People are complicated. Let's get a look at the shirts, Lewis. I was, I was gonna go with the. Then I wanna we'll do the. Uh, it's been a long day. The, the more yeah. funny uh, uh, choice. I'm fucking pissed. You didn't sleep last night. <sighs> nope. Let's get into bed. We need to sleep. This is. Hey, this one's pretty cool. Mm, looks like Marlin's jacket. Oh, yeah. But it would still look good on you. Uh, no, this one. Hey, look! It's Disco Broccoli and his friend. <sighs> I wish you could have seen this cartoon. Me too. Disco Broccoli, yeah. Hmm, this one will work. You can put it on when you feel better, okay? Yeah. Time for sleep. I can't sleep with the light. I'll blow it out in a second. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let a walker bite. And if it tries, <sighs> bang. And with that, folks, I'm going to cut it out here. Thank you for watching. Stay first and mental. And watch for the next video. <laughs> it's glad doing The Walking Dead back, even though it's the last game we're ever going to make. But I have hopes. I have hopes that uh, Telltale will like, come back from that uh, situation they have right now. But I doubt it. But still, I have hopes. They're still gonna, you know, come back from this, even though they only have like 25 people on board just to finish up the walk, uh, the, not the, uh, the Walking Dead and the uh, Minecraft Story Mode King uh, show for Netflix, but I don't know. I don't know. But thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Hit the bell notification button so you can watch later my videos, you know. I'm tired. It's 2.30 in the morning. I'm going to